What's going on? It's New the Barber back at it again with another haircut tutorial with the Rich Barber. Let's get straight into it. Today we're doing a high taper mullet with a slight texture on top. So right now, I'm sectioning the hair getting ready for the trimming phase. I'm now tilting the shears at a slight angle to add some texture to the top. The tool I'm using right now are thinning shears to add some volume and texture to the back of the mullet. I'm now using this crazy point cutting technique to add some more texture to the back of the mullet. And I'm now using seesaw spray to thicken the hair so I can add some texture to it. Now let's get into this fresh taper. I'm starting off with the lever close, making sure my lining is precise for my first guideline. I will now go over the bolt with the number four and make my way down. So we're now using my favorite technique, the point cutting, specifically for detail work. We're now coming in with a sheer over comb to debulk the front hairline. And now with the lever open with no guard, I'm coming in with the corners of the blade going up a half an inch. As you can see, I'm always using the corners of the blade. As you can see, I'm going back and forth with the half guard and the no guard open just to detail the taper using only the corner of the blade. Now using the Hanzo shears to detail the taper, a little more shear action. I'm now using the straight razor to create more of a pop. I'm now using the liners to get rid of the line I just created with the razor. I strongly recommend to start using the corners of your guys' blades to detail your guys' work. We're now getting into the lineup. It's all about staying calm and being precise with your lining. And now I'm taking off the bottom part of the table and coming in with the balding shaver. 
Yeah, it's that time. It's time to use the Ridge Barber hair fibers to top off this amazing blended taper. Look at that taper come to life using the Ridge Barber hair fibers. Using the same method on the other side, coming in with the lever closed using the half guard, and now with the lever open using no guard. Coming in with the liners to detail the front hairline. Being very precise with my liners. Coming in with the shaver hot to pop off the taper. Now it's always good barbers to lay your clients back so their neck is not breaking. I'm just coming in with the detail razor work. To finish it off, we're applying texturing powder all around his head to create layers and volume. Yeah! Look at this man come back to life. Let's go! There we have it, a high tapered textured mullet. I appreciate everybody who tuned in. Let's run up these numbers. Let's go!